Hey there, space enthusiasts. Welcome to SpaceX Front Page. Yesterday, history was made, and I can't wait to share all the epic details with you. So, SpaceX's Falcon 9 rocket launched from Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida, and it was nothing short of spectacular. It successfully delivered 23 Starlink satellites into low Earth orbit, but that's not all. This mission marked a groundbreaking milestone for SpaceX. For the first time ever, a Falcon 9 rocket landed in the Bahamas. Yeah, you heard that right. Liftoff happened at exactly 6, 22 p.m. EST, and just eight minutes later, the first stage made a controlled descent back to Earth. Instead of the usual drone ship in the open ocean, the rocket touched down on the just-read-the-instructions drone ship positioned off the coast of the Bahamas. This isn't just a cool landing spot. It's part of an awesome collab between SpaceX and the Bahamian government. Together, they're opening up new orbital trajectories and creating fresh opportunities for the aerospace industry in the region. This successful landing is a huge testament to SpaceX's relentless drive to innovate and expand its capabilities. By establishing a landing site in the Bahamas, SpaceX can now launch rockets into new orbital paths, enhancing both the efficiency and flexibility of their missions. Plus, it's a mega win for small nations like the Bahamas, giving them a chance to shine on the global aerospace stage and get involved in cutting-edge tech advancements. This workhorse has supported a variety of missions, from crewed flights to satellite deployments. Overall, the successful launch and landing of the Falcon 9 rocket in the Bahamas represent a major leap forward for SpaceX. It shows their unstoppable commitment to pushing the boundaries of what's possible and paves the way for future innovations in space travel and satellite deployment. So, if you were as hyped about this mission as I was, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Thanks for tuning in, and keep looking up.